Nobody is coming to do what? To rescue you. Nobody is coming. It is you that will get out of that hole. It's you. Nobody is coming. Nobody owes you anything. My brother, you don't help me. My sister, you, nobody owes you anything. My, my brother did not help me. Who helped your brother? When you are ready to crawl out, do you know that nobody can help you to become rich? Am I correct? Okay, if I give you five million naira, I say I dash you. Are you rich? Huh? Immediately you remove one hundred one naira from it. It's no more five million. In fact, if I give you five million now, you will not take down for go back home. What are you going to call? You call Uber. Because your mindset is not discipline for riches. It's not discipline for riches. That's the bane of many marriages. You are not disciplined in thinking. You are not disciplined in... Our phone has removed the destiny of so many people. 90% of your life is on phone. Gadget is on television. Washing. You are going to pray. Oh. I have great authors in the house that will never write a book because you are not disciplined. The way you talk, that's why your marriage is not moving forward. You are not disciplined. My wife and I will be handling a lady in a, in marriage cleaning from the last few weeks. What's the problem? She's not disciplined in thinking. The husband, a pastor, a fantastic child of God. What's that thinking? Eh, I should have married my ex. I should have married my ex. I should have married my ex. I'm not happy in this marriage. I'm not happy in this marriage. I'm not happy. I should have married. I said, who asked you not to marry your ex? He said, nobody. I just know that I can't marry him. But now that you are married, the person you marry, why don't you marry this one in your heart? I'm not happy. I'm not happy in this marriage. Huh? He said, my head is heavy. I want to check out. I want to check out. I'm hearing check out. Check out. Mm, I want to check out. I said, you are not disciplined. You want to destroy your life. It is when you are out and somebody else is marrying your husband, your eyes will be open. You remember that lawyer? That lawyer? That woman? Who said, I, last month, who said, I'm tired of my husband. I need a divorce. Now got a female lawyer. When they were talking, they were interrogating, the female lawyer discovered that the husband they wanted to divorce is a, is a fantastic man. And the lawyer was not married. So the lawyer just told the guy to cooperate quickly. And they cooperate. Within two months, they got the divorce. Within two weeks, she was married to the, to the man. Within two weeks. So as they were doing divorce, they were cutting. They were cutting. All the court cases, they would go and cut at the back. That's why they call it courtship. <laughs> they were two weeks. You know, get to the you know, this video. Ogba call me. Ogba people blambasted that. Ogba kini. You are divorced. You are divorced. I want everybody to take discipline serious. Ha, yeah, 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 yeah. You see, the, the Bible says, let me show you something in the Bible. The book of Job, chapter 36, verse 10. The book of Job, chapter 36, verse 10. Do you know that uh, the generation of many Christians, we are not... Uh, Let's let read it together. He opened also their ear to what? To discipline. And what? And commanded that they return from iniquity. They return from iniquity. They return from transgression. He opened their eyes. Brethren, you need to sit down. Which area am I heard? It's not about seeing now. It's not about what? It's not about seeing now. It's about iniquity. It's about transgression. It's iniquity is when you are not doing what you're supposed to be doing. And when you are doing what you are not supposed to be doing. The time you're supposed to sleep if you are not sleeping is transgression. The time you're supposed to read, students, we never read until one week to the exam. 
At average, you will score C. At average. But from 13 weeks, when they enter school, they will be gisting, they will be jesting, they will be doing fashion, they will be doing shows. When it is one week, they will read in the toilet, they will read in the kitchen, they will read in the... In, as they are pouring water on themselves, they are using one eye to read. And as the thing is coming through this place, it's coming out to... That's when they say they have some fever. And the body will now be doing high blood pressure. What did they normally happen to the car? Um, uh, overeating. The body will now be doing overeating. The radiator is the radiator is no more supply, supplying water. Raise up your two hands and you will declare. You will say in the name of Jesus. Say it very well. You say in the name of Jesus. Oh my spirit, become disciplined to fulfill destiny. Become disciplined to read the Bible. Become disciplined to do what I'm supposed to do. Become disciplined. Become disciplined. Aha! 